Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is going to be about the GearBot. And what it can do, um, and what you can do to make it a SpeedBot. So this is actually two robots in one. It is going to be very, very cool. You don't want to miss this. Stay with me. Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. What you see in front of you is the LEGO Mindstorms EV3 GearBot. Actually, it's the GearBot slash SpeedBot. And the only difference is what do you do with the gears? If you have it a certain way, it becomes the SpeedBot. If you flip it, it becomes the, the GearBot. So what we did is we took the instructions which I will put in the description for the build and, um, well, I mean, the program is left up to you. But the gear, as long as you can figure out how to, to set up your gears, it should be a great build. So on this one here, we have the 40 tooth gear as the driver gear, and then we have the 8 tooth gear as the driven gear, which turns this into a super fast speed bot. Look at that thing. As opposed to just a regular non-geared robot. So there's the difference in the speed. So watch that one. And then watch this one. Look at that. You can't even see that. You can't even see the white claw like going so super fast. So the gear ratio on this one would be the 40 to the 40 to 8. And so this makes it just a super fast robot. Let's go to the floor and watch these guys race. Okay, we have the Speedbot and the Riley Rover set up for a drag race here. Usually we use this for the Vex drag racing, but today we have the Speedbot here on the right, the Riley Rover on the left. I can't push both start buttons at the same time, but it's not even going to matter because this Riley Rover, I think you know, is going to get wiped out here by the SpeedBot. So I'm going to go ahead and start this Riley Rover, and then the SpeedBot will be like, oh, okay, we'll give you a head start. That is not even fair. Wow, the speed bot is in the kitchen having a sandwich while this guy didn't even go straight enough to finish. So this speed bot is just super quick. You just have to make sure that the gears don't slip because when they do, it could end up burning out. Let's watch this again. Go for it, speed bot. Wow, that is fast. And to be honest with you, it could go even faster if we went onto the computer and put this at 100% motor speed. Because right now it's only on the brick, so you guys know it's only 70%. So that is the speed bot part of this. Actually, when you look up the speed bot instructions, they're going to have a different gear ratio. But I had a student that just went, hey, what if we put the... 40 tooth gear along with that eight uh, tooth gear and they just wanted it to make it go as fast as possible so that is the highest gear ratio that you have in your ev3 kit um but that is just super fast okay let's go ahead now and take a look at the gear bot We gotta save it. Make sure it doesn't fall off. I'll let you like push it if it's going off. I stop it. Come on, make it up. <laughs> Not 
Okay, guys, there you have it. The GearBot slash SpeedBot. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Again, check out the description for the building instructions for it. It's really cool. Um, it was one of those things where you just see the eyes of the students light up uh, when they can see how, you know, of a steep incline it can go up, how fast it is. So it's really cool. Uh, keep in mind, again, guys, we're still telling me where you're from. If you did not see that video, check out the uh, end of the video. There's a the link to the video for that. Keep telling me where you're from. Tell me your name if you want to choose to. We're going to continue that until uh, the 29th of January. It's going to be such an epic video. Please participate if you can. Okay. I am Mr. Hino from Mr. Zyga Robotics. I'm out.